So the uh, the 5.5 inch we're going to launch next uh, next Tuesday, and uh, it's already available in a small quantity in the market right now. And uh, so the main selling point of this one is the uh, 4100 uh, uh, milliamp the battery uh, capacity. And uh, so also you can see here the screen ratio is 77.5%. And uh, so if you look at our competitors, they say even the flagship products, they are around, normally they are around 65 to 67%, but this one is already 77.5%. Uh, and so it's one of the major selling points. And using Gorilla Glass and the curve, uh, curve design, so 2.5D. And uh, so we believe that it's more, it's easier to hold and also it looks better. And so it's full metallic design and uh, there's uh, aluminum. Um, by cover. So let's try to uh, open it up. Yeah. Yeah. The SIM card first. Yes. So basically, it's also a dual SIM design, and uh, so we can put a nano SIM card and a micro SIM card, and or we can put a they say micro SD. And to open it, well, this one is the, uh, the this is the ER sample, so we already broke every broke it, <laughs> and uh, during the all the all the projects and all the testing, <coughs> and. Uh, is trying to get us a new one, but before that, mm -hmm. just to talk about the design. So the speaker, if you talk about 5.2 inch, 5.2 inch the speaker is here, but the 5.5 inch you put the speaker down there. Now when we open it, I'll talk about the, you know, the reason behind. And we have two screws, uh, two screws here, and using a micro USB uh, 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 this uh, uh, interface. So to open it, it should be. It forced the power into the <coughs> the gap here. Yeah, and because I don't do it every day, so <laughs> <laughs> so it may take a while for me to open it. It's supposed to be unibody. Sorry. It's supposed to be unibody. Uh, no, the unibody uh, model is the uh, another another device. So the, for this one, it's actually the three uh, three layers. So for this part, it's aluminium. Yeah, it should be like uh, for the metal part. It's always metal. Part, but yes, there must be some way to attach the screen. <laughs> you cannot have the screen in the body. <laughs> yeah. And so now it's open, almost open from here. <laughs> Alright, yes. right. so this is the uh, how it looks like inside. <coughs> okay. So basically, you can see they say from here, this is a full metallic aluminium body here. And the two pieces of the uh, plastic to make sure that the uh, the uh, R R S the antenna reception is a uh, signal reception is better. And so then, from the main device, you can see the fingerprint here. Okay. And uh, then we have the main camera, 60 megapixel. And uh, then on the other side, we have the 8 megapixel camera. And also here, if you look at the detail. 
if you come just look at this so here they are the flesh. the flesh but you can see there are two different colors white and yellow or orange because if it's only white color then we use flesh and the face color is not natural so just to uh, in imitate the na natural light and so that's why we put the two different LED here and here if you look at here this is the laser focus so it can focus can auto, auto focus within 0.03 seconds so that is one of the major setting points or the one, one of the major fe feature of the, uh, the camera uh, function of this device and uh, for the fingerprint you can see the spatial coating here just make it smoother and uh, also you can recognize you can, can I that? <laughs> yeah, 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 feel free, feel free, feel free. <laughs> yeah. and uh, so it, it's quite smooth and so you can recognize your fingerprint within 0.3 seconds also in all the different angles. Yeah. 360. 360, yep. And so, so if you look at the, the, the device, it main, basically is come from the main board and uh, the speaker module and the battery and the support. And so now I'm going to open it. So we have eight screws here to be opened, and this is a protection cover, just to fix the, uh, all the components together. And guys, I think you will take some time because our build quality is good. <laughs> yeah, so we have very complex uh, structure inside and to make sure that actually the longer time we spend you know the assembly of the device means the better you know build quality for the user. Yeah. So for instance just to compare a regular uh, assembly line that is uh, in terms of uh, if we remove the SMT I think it's around uh, 10 to 15 on uh, different stations. But for for instance for Zemo 3 and for Max that is up to 20 to 30 different stations to assemble it. Just one device. Is it possible to open the case without bro broke it? Uh, yeah, yeah, yes, <laughs> yes. Yes. I'm not sure how you, how you guys broke this one, but normally we use the uh, the reason we use this pick, not this pick, because this is softer. So if we just like this one, I, ju I think I was using this one, and it's already broken. And uh, then because if I use this one, and it will be this one broken. But basically, we need to make it, I mean, to, yeah, we need to make it very difficult to open because if you look at some other devices, uh, well, in our earliest generation, the mechanical part is, yeah, it's also solid, but easier to open, and the end users, they may actually just do it by themselves. And that is not the most preferred situation because they might break it some way.
So now remove the front cover. So here you can see all the major components here. So basically, still when I okay, I'm going to take it out so you can see the both sides. Because on main board, we have one side, we have all the components on this side and also the other side. So it'll be easier for me to explain when I they say when I remove the other side as well. And at the same time, actually, I'm going to open the support together. So up there we have eight screws and here we have six screws. This is the support. Actually, this is the uh, uh, this is the speaker. You oh, speaker. See, yes, you see it. This is the chamber. So, if you look at this design of this uh, this model, we separate the uh, speaker from the main board because most they say if you look at a lot of uh, uh, phones, they put their speaker on their main board and uh, but for, from our side we like to it to be a separate module. The reason is because if we put in a separate module and then you can make a closed chamber design. In a closed chamber design the subwoofer and also the sound quality can be better. And uh, so this is that's what we have on this device. As also because of 5.5 inch so we can have more space mm -hmm. for the separate module. And then so this is the this is the this is the antenna the uh, yeah the antenna and now we can open the, the rest uh, not a battery yet I'll get this one first so take out take away the main board
this is the main board. So this is a speaker, the main board. The next step is I'm going to remove the support. <coughs> and this one is very fragile. What is it? Screw is still on. Yeah, you can screw it. Yes, the screw is still on. Oh, oh shit! <laughs> yeah, no, it's alright. You okay. didn't break it. But the rubber just fell off. Can you help me to find the rubber? Yeah. Oh, the yeah. So this is the USB cover, the rubber for USB, right? So I won't break anything yet. I'll <laughs> <laughs> just put it in. Yeah, I give it a battery. Three? Sure. I'm just speaking for power. Uh, yeah. So this is how it looks like.